What started off as a Saturday afternoon hike turned to a Coast Guard rescue in the Porcupine Mountain State Park. The man was spotted by the Coast Guard after starting a fire and waving his lighter in the air. We were able to get on scene, locate him, and put our rescue swimmer down to uh, give him instructions on how to get into the helicopter. We loaded down a basket and hoisted him up. It's something Coast Guard rescue crews say they see a lot in the fall and winter. We're so connected via cell phone these days that everybody feels as though they can always just pick up the phone when they're out in the woods or on the boat and give somebody a call. And that's not necessarily the case. Uh, the further that you get away from civilization, uh, there's a good chance that you're going to be out of range. It's important to always let someone know where you're going. That's something shooters in Traverse City stresses to their customers that are going out to hunt. Let them know where you go, what time you're going to be back, where you park, uh, which way you're going to the woods from your parking space and mark your trail. The Coast Guard also recommends having a personal locator beacon. It uses satellite, so it will always have a signal. You can use that to signal somebody, send a message that you're in trouble. So having a secondary way to communicate with somebody is super important. But it's a good idea to have a backup. GPS is our batteries. If battery runs out, what do you have? You know, if you have a map, you can still read a map.